Hello everybody, SB Slayer here, and welcome back to House Flipper. Now today we're going to be doing some random jobs. I wasn't going to record something else today, but um, that fucked up. Didn't work very well. Um, so we're, going to, we're just going to record House Flipper today, because I, I guess today is just going to be a house flipping day. Uh, I hate when there's recording issues. It, uh, it's annoying. But, you know, we can get some stuff done, at least. And I should probably... I'm debating, should I focus on those or should I focus on the map of jobs? Or should I just go browse? Because I still have three houses to sell. Well, two houses to sell, because I need to... I need to do this garden. And this is the house I have to sell. This is the one I'm currently staying at for now. <laughs> Speaking of, what's the next house? You know, let, 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 let's buy let's buy the house with an uninvited guest. I feel like we should start buying some of these things, and then slowly flip them over time. <laughs> Which, you know, is going to require a lot of redecorating of the houses. Okay, let's just clear out this area. This is going to take a lot of just. De-weeding and bullshit. Someone get the weed be gone. Ugh. Ugh. This house is trash to shit. Holy hell. Why is there this weird screen tearing that's going on my screen? I don't know, maybe I have the wrong... ...graphics quality settings. For my PC. There we go. Let me just stand this up. Can I sell that? Yes, I can. Okay, I'm gonna make a bit of money back off of all the shitty looking furniture in here. Oh, roaches. That'll be a definite thing that I'm going to get rid of here in a second. Why is there someone else's clothes here? Alright. Give me this. Hoover them up. Get hoovered. Be gone. Be gone, little bastards. Come on. Get them. Get them all. Every last one. Pretty sure I just clean something without needing to clean it. <laughs> Because that cobweb just vanished. That's right. Fuck him up. Come on. Got this vac- I wish there was an upgrade for the vacuum. It feels very underpowered. I'll worry about picking up the plates and shit later. <laughs> For now, just get rid of these shits. Come on. Be gone. Every last one of you. There we go. Destroyed the nest. Ugh, this is like a spider heaven. I hate it. I love having the max clean. Max cleaning skill. Because it just 
literally just gathers all of the junk on the floor and just fucking pulls it. That's a much nicer looking painting. I might just keep that there. That wall's gonna need a major repair. Be gone, dirt and grime. That's a rusty ass shelf. Okay, these chairs are good, but I might just sell them. The couch is actually intact. I'm surprised. I wish I could like do that repair mini game from the luxury DLC on anything. I feel like that would make sense. Considering if we're able to do it in like to like one or two things, I feel like we should be able to do it to just about anything. You know, I was hoping that cleaning up the tat rack would actually make it look not like garbage, but no, that thing is just garbage. That that belongs in the garbage. Still some dirt left. Well, yeah, I haven't cleaned the fucking house fully. Shut up, people on the sidebar. You're like a grouchy YouTube comment section over there. Which, luckily, mine is not like that yet. Hopefully, it'll never be like that. One can hope, but it'll probably will. There's garbage. Who hid boxes behind the fucking couch? Fucking hiding boxes behind the couch. That's fucking ridiculous. Spider web, be gone. That's a shattered mirror. They're on the bed, I'm guessing? Oh god, lag. Getting lag in a single player game. Yeah, there's definitely something wrong with my settings on this game right now. There was a new update today. Um, or yesterday or something. Actually, I think it was like two days ago, but... Yeah, there was a recent update. They, like, uh, added an entire new house so we can get added more quests to luxury DLC thing. Which, is fridge even... Yeah, it's sellable. Let's get rid of it. Be gone. <laughs> Same with this tail. That's sellable? Wow, that's a... These are sellable? Sell the random articles of clothing around. Especially sell this. That looks like garbage. Now there should be enough space for all my books. I feel like selling the the bookshelf should decrease that. But okay, sell all of these. Let's get rid of that. Sell this disgusting looking piece of junk. Sell these because they're fucking destroyed looking. I think anyone cares about the fucking silverware and all that. There we go, paintings. Everyone loves paintings. Need a bucket of plaster to fill a little more. Uh, how do I get plaster? Glass walls. I need glass walls. No. Um. Alright, they added a bunch of new stuff. Um, plaster. Yes, please. Uh, I'm actually gonna put two down, because there's a lot of busted walls here. <laughs> Switch to plastering.
I see this kind of counts as painting, I think. I'm just gonna drag this around with me. To all these walls that need work. For obvious reasons. That's a large amount of plaster there. Covering up these holes is ridiculous. God, I'm gonna have to sell and replace all of these doors because they look disgusting. Ugh. Give me plaster. 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 Pretty sure that fills in the majority of the holes. Well, I say that, and yet there's still holes all over the place. Did I miss any in this room? Ah, did I miss any in this room? Nope. Yeah, nope. Okay, plaster. Repair the wall. Why do I hear something? Oh, oh, oh god, I didn't even see that. I didn't even see these guys. These guys blend in. That's kind of disgusting. All of you just get sucked in, please. A big on, little fuckers. Yeah, I, I wish I could have used, like, the flamethrower to just burn them all. That wasn't funny. Maybe I should try that sometime and just see if I see if we can burn the cockroach nests in this game. That'd be very, very entertaining. Alright, sell this. And I'm gonna have to replace the doors to the outside here. In a minute. But. For now. Get rid of all these. Disgusting. Grimy ass doors. Switch to plastering. Plaster up the wall. Is that all the plastering this wall needs? I think so. That is a massive cobweb. If this is cobweb size that size in your fucking house, um you might have a problem. <laughs> there may be massive fucking mutant spiders in your walls. <laughs> oh my god, this yard is disgusting. Not only is it overgrown, but there's weeds everywhere. Hold on. I had to at least carve a path for myself. Oh my god, you legitimately have to, like, hop through this. Max speed. Get down the weeds! Be gone, little bastards. God, this fucking... The weirdest thing about the weeds in the garden DLC is for some reason they have hitboxes. Like, they're physical objects instead of, like, the grass. Which is not a physical object. 
Which just literally means that they gave them hitboxes. Which is an odd choice. To an extent. It's just like, why, why would you want the... Why would you want the things that you're gonna have people walk around? I have hitboxes. But then again, when you think about it, you can pull the weeds. It's so you can locate the weeds easier. Because otherwise you wouldn't even know they're there. Because sometimes the grass is like this in the fucking jungle. Pretty almost clear a section of this. Wow, you can get this tractor, or this lawnmower to go fast. I don't know why I was saying tractor. Oh yeah, probably because my dad calls most riding lawnmowers tractors. Even though this isn't a riding lawnmower, but ha it having horsepower makes it feel like one. <laughs> In a weird way. In a really, really weird way, it does feel kind of like a normal, like, riding lawnmower. Which I've driven before. They're, they're interesting. <laughs> they're very, very weird. Ah. Let me through. Get all this. Grab this. And... Now we get off because I'm not doing that all in this video. We're first going to, like, focus on doing some random shit. I don't know what to talk about in this video, so I'm just going to talk about the game itself. <laughs> Which... I'll say, I, I kind of want to mention my thoughts on this game. This this game is very fun. It's interestingly just in-depth with how its systems work. Uh, but it, all, it also just sometimes it's, it's it's a mixed bag. Like, some, some of the missions are in-depth and interesting and then others are just like, eh, we've done this like 20 times. But then there's ones that are just like, yo, you do something new for once. Which are always intriguing, because there's just like, that variety exists. That's a busted cabinet. But yeah, again, there's... A lot of variety in this game. It's very weird. It's a weird mixed bag of fun, but in the weird... It's not fun normally, like in real life, but then it's fun in the game. It's weird. It's, it's a weird sensation. <laughs> it's a very odd choice for games. It's just like, hey, we're doing something that's normally considered boring, and then all of a sudden it's just like, hey, it's actually fun. <laughs> but again, I feel like that's everyone who plays this game, just like, why is this fun? <laughs> why is this oddly fun and satisfying? To just do exactly what you would do in real life, but then it's in a video game. <laughs> It's one of those ridiculous things. But I'll just put in the radiators and... Some things... Not matching up right. I think I think this room is supposed to be slightly bigger. But anyway, we're gonna put these big-ass radiators in this house. Heating is not gonna be a problem for this house. At all. Every room has a fucking massive radiator. Except for in here, because there's that's not going to fit. We're going to put the normal size radiator. Screw it on. Twist that cap, and boom. Everything is now installed for those. 
There, I figured I could pick those up. Not seeing anything like damaged on those plugs. That's another one of those missions. It's like a mission that sends you going around a house trying to locate like rusty, burnt out looking plugs. And that's the entire mission, and that that is a very good mission. Because it's just like, hey, you know you've been uh renovating all these houses? Yeah, here's one where you just have to clean it and then find the plugs. <laughs> That was it. It was very refreshing to do a, just a normal, chill mission. But yeah, I think that's all I'm gonna do for this house for now. For a number of reasons. One of which being, I'm almost out of time for this video. <laughs> um, but yeah, you know what? I'm gonna fix this fucking lawn one thing that I have. Before I end the video. I know someone's going to start losing their shit. Because of how weird I did this. You know, it, I... I know that some people are just like, wow, people are going to lose their shit over that. There are people that will lose their shit if they see, like... The slightest lack of symmetry. And it's not like they try to, it's literally their brain is just hardwired to react illy to that. And that is why they react like that. It's it's a weird thing. It's a lot of really weird things in human brains that, that just trigger weird reactions. It's all, in all honesty, there's, there's just a lot of weird shit in the world. <laughs> the, the, the world is just a weird existence that we all share to some extent. Pretty sure I got all the grass. Never mind. Let me just use the bush cutter here. Chop down some of these. Yeah, chop down all these. See, they're not needed. Nor welcome, because they're just... There's no... They're not in a spot that would make sense for, like, a garden. <laughs> so just gonna chop them down. I'm actually surprised that the lawnmower didn't just take them out. Now if it was actually behaving like a lawnmower... It, these plants would not be alive. They'd be in shreds, like grass. There we go. Cut all these away. Be gone, there we go. That's real weird. I'll probably have to put some turf there. Um... But, yeah, I'm not seeing anything off. Anyway, I am going to end this video here. Um, I hope everyone has enjoyed it. If you should join the ranks of the SCP Foundation, don't shoot that like button, slay those comments, and contain that subscribe button. Anyway, guys, I'll see you on the next video, live stream, or whatever next. Peace, guys!